What's up, it's your boy Jamar, and I am here with my first official vlog. Um, I just kind of wanted to kind of capture some of the moments of when I first moved from Dallas, Texas to Atlanta, Georgia to attend uh, John Marshall uh, School of Law. And it's been a crazy past like 60 days, past two months, uh, but we did it. We're here, we're here in Atlanta, Georgia um, this week or tomorrow, starting tomorrow on Monday. We actually resumed because we had one on Saturday. It was our first official orientation date. Um, but tomorrow on Monday, we resume. We pick up where we left off and we finish out this orientation to get ready for school to start on August 15th. So let's jump straight into the video um, and then you guys can kind of catch up and see where I've been. So I'm gonna show you guys around my apartment. Unfortunately, um, I didn't get to do an empty apartment tour, but you guys will kind of see what it looks like now. As you walk in to the left here is my laundry area. It's the stackable washer and dryer. Um, it's convenient. I like that apartment came with it. To the right here you'll see is my kitchen area. Um, and as you walk through that hallway, you'll see I have my TV set up. I tried so many different times to get that TV mounted. It just didn't work out in my favor. Um, so I'll have to get that taken care of. But then here you see, we have a nice view of the Mercedes-Benz Stadium. It's a really good view, especially being a law student um, and in school, like a full-time student. Um, I was really happy to be able to have an apartment that I was comfortable in. And that also came with this really amazing view of downtown Atlanta. Um, as you can see here, I have my office area, my desk with all my school supplies. It was wash day, so there's a ton of clothes on the bed. Um, and then with having a, an apartment that is um, so small, I tried to get really creative in maximizing my space and made sure I used every inch <laughs> that I could. So, um, We'll walk into the bathroom here. You'll see I have the glass shower. I've got a few of my supplies on the on the sink area, but I've always wanted one of these glass showers, so that was a really cool perk as well. Um, but that's it. That's the entire apartment. I have a studio apartment in downtown Atlanta, um, and I haven't had any issues or anything like that, so it's been a great experience so far. All right, so today is Thursday. Um, and it's kind of the end of the day and orientation or well, the first day of orientation is on Saturday. So I've got so much homework to finish before then. I've kind of been procrastinating on that. Additionally, I'll be doing like a book opening just so you guys can see what all books arrive. I got a, like maybe four or five books that have came in. So I'll show you guys that. I'll go through that with you. Um, and then we'll close up this vlog. Hey guys, so what I'm doing right now is I am procrastinating. I have a lot of work that I need to get done before orientation starts on Saturday. And today is Thursday. It's about 2.45 right now, 2.40. And I'm going to go get food. I just came from Walmart. I just came from shopping to go and like stock up my fridge, kind of get some snacks. Cause I feel like this is going to be a long, um, night and a long couple of next days so um right now i'm going to go get food so and if like you see my story and you kind of know what's going on then you know that american deli is like my go-to spots that's another thing so being here in atlanta you kind of realize that like um the culture is way different like in Dallas, when I go to a restaurant, like I expect good service. I expect the people to be smiling and to kind of give you the best service possible. But here, I just haven't ran into that. Like people are just kind of who they are and it is what it is. So I don't know, it's weird. Yo, so one thing about Atlanta that is kind of weird and that I didn't expect is that all of their streets are like extremely steep. Like everywhere I go it looks like Sacramento or San Francisco where the streets are like almost at a 90 degree angle. It's crazy, I didn't expect that. All right, so I just made it back to the house. 
I had to do another grocery store run, but I finally got some food in my apartment. I've been here like a week and a half. And well, actually tomorrow will be two weeks, uh, but I finally was able to get some food and stuff. Uh, so I'm gonna take you guys through what I got. And then... All right, so I did a whole explanation and just kind of talking you guys through everything I bought, but I didn't really like how I explained everything. So I'm just gonna talk to you guys now. So I got all this different stuff, cereal, oatmeal, fruit snacks, chips, condiments, canned goods, all that good stuff is in this pantry cabinet that's closest to my door. Um, next, I'm taking you guys through the fridge. Um, just got some more condiments. I always drink almond milk, vanilla con. If you know, you know, please don't judge me. Yes, I drink Diet Cokes. I got sweet tea, some waters. Got my deli drawer with all my cheeses, all my lunch meats. All that stuff is essential. I love making sandwiches, so that's definitely a go-to. Um, down below in my freezer, I didn't get much for the freezer, uh, but I did grab some ice cream. So I got my first books for the semester. I think, I believe. I open this up and see. See which book came in first and of course right now i don't feel good at all i have like this massive headache nose is stopped up i don't know what's going on i just started feeling bad all right so it is my first book and can you guys guess which one it is or i guess for which class my eye looked like it was like lazy, and I guess it is. Uh, but it is for contracts. This is the very first book I received in the mail for my upcoming 1L year. And it's crazy because like, I just put in the order for my books on, I think Monday. So that's crazy that this came in this fast, but it goes one step closer to 1L and then eventually graduating law school. All right, so today is the first day of orientation and I'm ready. All right, so it's probably a little loud right now just because there's a train going by. Um, and my neighbor, his dog is like going crazy right now. So if you guys hear that, pay no attention to it. Um, I just want to quickly stop in and say, I just got done with the first day of orientation for law school. Um, and it wasn't as strenuous or as scary as I thought it was gonna be. Um, because there was so much preparation work done for uh, orientation, I thought it was going to be a lot more intense, a lot more uh, scary. And surprisingly, um, like pleasant, I was pleasantly surprised by how it was and how um, helpful and knowledgeable and useful all of the um, information was. Um, like the staff, they were extremely helpful, they were knowledgeable. Um, and they were really just trying to prepare us for what's like what's ahead, you know Today we met at instead of meeting at the actual Campus of John Marshall here in Atlanta. We met at um, the state of Georgia's like state bar um, Headquarters, um, so that was pretty cool. We got to see the building. We got to see some of the mock classrooms uh, past presidents of the state board um, here in Georgia um, and then we also did like a couple of breakout sessions to where you go with your um, group. And I was a part of group 10. Um, and so you go with your group, it's led by attorneys like who are like alumni for Atlanta's John Marshall, um, who've been practicing for a while, who've got like a ton of experience. And so it was really cool to see them kind of come back and say, hey, this is, was my experience in law school. This is my experience now. 
this is what you have to look forward to. Um, of course, everybody's going to have their own journey, their own path, but uh, from a foundational perspective, this is what you can expect. And so I thought that was really cool. And then we also went through like these scenarios of like, if you're put in this position, what happens? Um, like, what do you do? How do you handle it? How do you take care of this? Um, because today was mainly about, and then the fire truck wants to go by, like, what's going on? <laughs> uh, but today was mainly about, um, like, ethics, professionalism. Uh, we took um, some oaths by the, it's a Fulton County judge um, who came to speak to us and did a presentation. We took a couple of oaths. We took the lawyer's creed. We took um, the Atlanta John Marshall's oath or creed and um so it was pretty pretty exciting pretty um informational um just kind of saying hey this is what we expect from an ethics moral professional um like standard this is what we expect and so that was pretty much it we got out maybe like an hour early so i'm about to take a nap maybe find me some good food to eat um today's saturday the 6th i believe and we start back up on monday um and so i'm out this wraps up this blog tired hungry ready to go to sleep i'll talk to y'all next time peace